Situated on the northern edge of the Atlantic coast in North America, Nova Scotia has played an important role in the history of geology. The first geological map was produced by Charles Jackson and Francis Algier in 1834. Uh, geologists traveling from Boston uh, up the coast into the Bay of Fundy and a lot of the attention they gave to the geology was situated in the Bay of Fundy. But on the Atlantic coast, the Halifax Harbor was an important point for travel into North America from England and the historic Dartmouth Commons that looked out onto the uh, Halifax Harbor uh, portrays a scene from 1849 um, uh, that shows the Halifax Harbor as a busy port. The first geological map that identifies the glacial striations in Halifax Harbor was produced by David Honeyman in 1883. Uh, he produced this map on top of an, an older nautical chart um, from 1859, and he marked on the map the direction of the glacial striations that were visible at Point Pleasant Park. During this tour, we're going to look at the glacial striations on the other side of the harbor in Dartmouth. 